Yo, what's going on guys? It is me, Hammers, and today is my second ever video and I'm going to show you how to do, how, sorry, no, not how to do, how to record a video only on Xbox One. So you're going to need two apps for this and they're both free and I'm going to show you how to get them now. So they might come with the Xbox One, but if they're not, so as you can mind, the game DVR's there and right at the very end should be uh upload studio but you can have voice studio as well because that can that's like audacity um that can that uh if you just speak it can like improve your voice and stuff like that pretty much so what we're gonna do is we are going to go to the apps we just store apps there you go and you can go browse all apps and then just click in game dvr once you've got D game dvr download it and then you want to click up sto upload studio download that one as well so i've already downloaded them so what you want to do is you want to go to upload studio first of all and it comes into this main menu so what you want to do is you want to click record a new game clip now you want to exit out of this and you want to go to your game as you can see, I was just playing some random spots. Now, you want to exit that and go back into this. And then you'll click start new clip and then start recording. Now, you can, in fact, uh, just leave it like this. So, then you know you can only record up to five minutes. But if not, uh, if you just want to cut it out and just like, you can just cancel this bit and then... You can just like keep checking it. But I like it like this so they can still see the whole screen. It's just that's there for you so you can stop when you finish. So I'm just going to play like a minute of Black Ops 3 without any editing. So I'll just play it. And yeah. Alright, cool. So let me just wait for it to load. Now I just made one quick class and just went because I just wanted to do like a demo. So let's do this. Alright, I just got to change team. No, what am I doing? Change team. Are we, are we good? All right, here we go. So I just got my friend with me here. D Padilla. And then we got the rest of them. He's going to go in there and I'm just going to go to this corner here. I can see a few of them. I'm tempted not to rule one just in case. I'm just going to rule one anyway. Flank these guys. Fair enough, so that's one kill pretty much. Two kills. Uh if if I'm not speaking as much because I'm concentrating. Overwatch down. Should have stayed cloaked, man. Right, so I'm five kills. Cool. Now I'm not like really good at COD, but I'm I'm all right, I guess. That aim though. Sector down. Target down. I'm just gonna move over this side. Just gonna flank this guy. The guy's not there. Get that guy. Um. There you go. Down. Right, cool, so we're good. So I'm just gonna go. God damn it, alright. We got bloodthirsty. Firebreak KIA. Drop them. Great. Ah, oh, it was close, it was close. Alright, so as you can see, I'm rec I've recorded at least two, well, three minutes now, so I'm just going to record, like, one little bit of gameplay. Threat neutralized. Shot out! Alright, it goes 8-5. We'll get up to 25 kills. Cheeky free kills there. Uh. 
in my sights. Lays them lot down. So now we've almost done the clip. Right, so we'll just end it here. So now you just click quick game or just edit that. So then what you want to do is you want to exit this and you click there. Then you want to click stop recording. So there's three minutes and 54 seconds recorded. So now what you want to do is just want to wait until it's just done. So as you can see, it's now done that. So then you want to click Upload Studio. You can forget about your game, it doesn't even matter. Then you want to click Record a new cl game clip. No, sorry, start from scratch, sorry. Now, once you're on this, I've now recorded six minutes, so that's fine. So now you want to click Change Type, I think it is. Yeah, here we go. And then you want to click Intro. Then you can click Change Effect, so choose any one you want. So I'm just going to choose... Uh, I'm just gonna choose the explosion. So now, now I'm gonna, I'm gonna choose this one. And you click add text. So I'm just gonna call it demo, just to show you guys. So demo, there you go. So it's just random. And then you wanna click add here. Then you click add clip, and it should store on your cloud straight away. And I've actually recorded loads of clips. Some of them I actually don't even want. As you can see, most of these I didn't actually want any of these. They're just there. For some reason. But they've sort of like updated it now. So as you can see, here's the clip. Now once it's downloaded, you just want to click. Just wait till it's downloaded. There you go. So now what you want to do is you want to click change effects sorry yeah and here like that there you go so it's like a so we're gonna click that one and add text and this will be the thing at the top right hand corner of the screen so let's just put in demo again so demo now you've only got 20 characters so you have to like be quite Good. Like you need to, you need to like think on what you're gonna do, and then click change type, add a new one, change type, click outro, then change effects, choose whatever one you want. So I'm just gonna click this one. I'm just gonna put once again, just put demo, but you can put thanks for watching, uh, subscribe, stuff like that. So as you can see, there's the whole thing that's there. So that's all done, and then click finish. Now, you can click a title. So I'm just gonna call it once again demo. There you go, so demo's there, and you can click OneDrive. Now, if you click OneDrive, it will load, but I'm not going to put it. But uh, the way you do it is, if you click OneDrive, what would happen is it would store onto your OneDrive, and then if you access it from Xbox One, you can actually put it onto your PC and then edit it there. But it's not much point because you've already edited it. Now what you want to do is... As you can see, it's now rendering. So I'm going to pause the video and wait till it's rendered. And then once it's rendered, I'll show you how to do that. So I'll see you guys in a minute. So I'm now back. So then once it's done rendering, it should say sharing to upload. And what would then happen is at just, uh, just above the bar, it should say upload. And it might say like 4.2 MBIT slash S. So that means megabytes something i forgot per second whatever so once again i'm just gonna and it changes but sorry just just remember this um you need good internet uh for this to be quite fast but uh, my internet is quite good uh so yeah but um another thing is you got to look at the time and uh the time is quite important because if you've made a clip which is four minutes and then added a transition and then made another clip which is let's say another four minutes that's eight minutes plus the intro and outro now you need good internet and that will at least take about i'll say half an hour to render and upload but that's if you've got good internet but once when i had my bad internet uh i think that was like six no 
that would have been yeah about six months ago actually six months ago we had a terrible internet like our internet was so bad and we just had to change and now it's really fast but before we had that internet and basically what happened was we sort of like I did a video and it was eight minutes long and it took me two whole hours to just do this and this is when I had like my first ever channel and I just did it like that so one last thing I want to say is with the internet just remember I know it it, it for me it, it as you can see it's on 44 percent it looks like it's going quite slow but as soon as you uh, turn your computer like pc because uh, i'm using the elgato capture card thing basically what's happening is it would just bit uh, it's hard to explain but it's just using a bit more internet so it, this is why it's uploading slower so once again i'll see you guys in a minute and i'll tell you what to do when it's finished so guys as you can see it is now finished so as you can see it says it says tick and then it says your up your video has been uploaded it says 100 percent. it may tick take a little while before it appears to upload so that means that it's pretty much done so what you can do now is you can actually play the clip if i remember you can't you can there you go so just click x and it should just say demo as you can see let's just have a look, quick look as you can see, we'll just fast forward a bit. As you can see, it, it is a fully working clip, basically. So, now it's all done. Now, the thing is, it when the blue ticket might say a red cross, and that means something isn't right that you haven't done. Now, if you tell me what it is, I'll like make sure I'll show you what to do. So, now you've done that. Now the whole time I actually forgot to unsnap this, but it, it don't matter. So now what you want to do is you want to have the final app, and I forgot to put this in the first stuff. So click My Games and Apps. Uh, if you don't have it, just download it off the App Store, and obviously it's YouTube. So now I'm on YouTube, so let me just wait for it the uh, home menu to load. So let's just wait, and then it should go red, and then black with white and red as it usually should do now as you can see it's now here so i have my old channel up there now if i click uploads as you can see there is no videos now what you want to do is you, you say for example you're not signed in yeah say for example you're not signed in so what you want to do is you want to click your d-pad and just click left and it should bring this thing here now, for example, if I click home, it'll go to all these things that I haven't looked at, even though it's this recommended channel. Okay, anyway, so uh, here's home, and but bef it should say sign in, and just click sign in, sign your email address, and then your password for YouTube, and it should, you can choose which one. And then what you want to do is you want to click uploads, and click A with upload. Now, if you click A with that, it should show you all the clips. Check and see, we've got this one, and this is the unedited version, and then it just basically just does that. So you click A. Um, I'm going to put it on private because I don't want people to see it, and then just click OK. So, upload. As you can see, you need more waiting to do, so now you just got to wait for it to actually load now once it's loaded it should just give it like a minute or two look back and it should say your video has been successfully uploaded to youtube or something like that and then look at it and it would say oh the video is there oh this is cool then people can then look at it and obviously it's not the best it's it's good quality actually it's really good quality but it's not the best sort of let's say i'm trying to think it's not the best like edited thing but if you don't want to just do edit and just look at walk through stuff like that this is the thing you want to use so anyway i don't need to do this video but once this is done just click okay and then there you go so 
I'm just going to click cancel. And anyway, thank you guys for watching. Smack that like button until it bleeds. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.